welcome back to another episode. I am just on the beach right now. The sun is almost about to set and it is super windy. So I'm gonna make this really, really quick because I actually didn't think I was gonna get a video out today. So for all of you that are watching this video and this is your first time, my name is Melanie Kate Love and I'm gonna help you raise your vibration, trust your intuition and learn to love yourself, flaws and all. So, are you ready for my little life update? Because, oh my gosh, Things have been absolutely crazy lately. Oh my God. So I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, but if you don't, I highly recommend you do. That's where I tend to go live. I just came off a live just then to share my new tarot deck with you guys. And I'm a little bit out of breath because I was literally running to this spot. Um, just, yeah, the sun's about to go down. Look at this. I'm just turning you around so I can give you a quick little view. Like, this is my local beach. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Anyway, so this is kind of like a little vlog style. I'm hiding next to these trees to kind of like block the wind because it's crazy out. So a lot has happened. I have manifested, well Peter and I have manifested our new car, which was super exciting. So now we have transport, which basically means freedom. Um, and then I heard that song, That's Freedom, from John Farman. Um, then, oh my gosh, so much came up with the new moon in Libra, which is all about relationships. It mirrored a lot to me. I have been receiving signs for about the past month. I hope you guys can hear me. I have been receiving signs for about the past month saying that I need to go back home. Oh my gosh, I'm falling down in hell. And I was like, are you serious? Like, I know we're in a lot of Piscean energy and it's super emotional. It's probably not the best time to be making decisions. Anyway, so I started hearing that song um, from my hometown, from uh, Adele. That came up so many times. If you watch my weekly angel guidance, you would have noticed that. What was the other thing that happened? Oh my gosh, seeing so many numbers. Then um, I spoke to my mom and she said, she actually manifested for me to come home. Um, I'm not too sure, I haven't really told you guys too much, but my mom and dad are going through a divorce right now. Super messy. Family is, as you can imagine, not coping. And I feel like I need to go home to help out my mom, mend my relationship with my sister because we don't really speak and we used to be like this, like joined at the hip. And to see my brother, he's just bought a house and now he's got a girlfriend and um, a child. This is like, everything is just happening so quick. And there was like all these signs and I was like, why does the universe want me to go back home? Like where my family lives, there is no one there that is living the life that I want. And I'm not inspired there, but I'm like, okay, I am where I am and it's okay. Everything is working out with, for me. I'm trusting the process. It took a lot of surrendering, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of surrendering, a lot of tears, lots and lots of tears. Yeah, oh my gosh, my loves. I talk about crying to release the pain, so there's no tears left. I was speaking to one of you guys in the comment, I think she was on a Mel T. She told me in the comments that she lost her husband or her partner last year. And I told her, just cry in the shower. Crying, it just like the water just washes away the pain after you've released it. Um, so I've been doing a lot of crying and I've just, I just like, since I decided that I'm going to move, by the way, I'm moving to Mackay. So that is 12 hours north from where I live on the Sunshine Coast. It's not just an hour and a half drive. It's a 12 hour drive to go there. Um, yeah, ever since I've seen that, I've seen prices of, um, for houses to rent, super cheap. What Peter and I pay here for a studio, we can get a three bedroom. What? So um, that's crazy. Oh, I don't even know if you can hear me. Oh God, it's like flyaway central. Um, yeah, so moving back home. Oh, another thing. I will be changing up my whole business structure. I will be offering only coaching. I won't be doing angel readings anymore. I will not be doing, um, offering the Forgiveness Heals Guided Visualization. So if this is something that you have wanted, I highly recommend that you um, 
book a session or purchase the meditation because that's going to be gone soon. I felt like with my, I love doing my meditations. I love doing the angel readings. What I noticed with the angel readings is I felt that I needed to have a structure in place. I would give my clients the readings and I'm like, okay, watch this video, do this, do this, do this. And I'm like, I really need to coach them through the process um, because there was, there's just so much, so much that you need to do to work through and there's so many different levels to address um, that I couldn't just give them enough clarity just over email. I was like, I really want to coach people. And so I prayed. I literally was on the ground crying, asking for the universe for help. I was like, angels, I need help with my business. What can I do? They sent me the divine guidance. They sent me this fabulous course that I invested thousands of dollars in. And I'm so excited. I'm literally so excited. I haven't invested money like this in my business since I started. Like when I was learning, when I was studying plant-based nutrition through Cornell University in the state of New York. Oh my gosh, so like there's a lot that's been happening. Anyway, so I'm super excited. I'm gonna be learning about restructuring my whole business. You'll be able to, just, I don't know if I'm gonna vlog the process. I don't really know how I'm going to do it yet, but I just feel like I needed to change things up. And then when I check the astrology to find out what's going on in my chart, um, I can't remember the name. Something was in my ninth house and I don't really understand astrology, but like, oh my gosh, all of these transits were happening within the month that I've decided that I'm going to move. So um, yeah, so I got a new car. Peter and I are gonna be moving to Mackay. Um, not indefinitely. I think that's just until we get assigned to move. I feel like we're gonna to move to Ireland after that, I'm not sure. Um, and I wanna have kids sometime soon too, but I feel like I need to have my business established before I can do that. Um, yeah, it's all happening guys, all happening. Comment below and please let me know what is going on for you? What has come up for this full moon in Libra, this relationships? Has it shaken things up? Like I'm so interested to hear how you guys are going. And I just wanted to pop in to do a quick little impromptu video. Haven't even got the full face of makeup on. I did a little bit of the eyebrows, a little bit of a mascara, and I was like, I've got to go! Um, yeah, as you can see, I have the beach to myself. What? And yeah, I'm moving. I'm moving. Do you believe that? Like, I love this place here. Like, I love it so much, but I never made friends here. I've been here for over a year and this is the first place I've ever moved. Mind you, this is the first time I ever started a business, so I isolated myself. And I didn't make an effort to meet people. And I don't know if I unconsciously knew that this was never going to be my home and I didn't need to find roots, but Peter did uh, make friends here. So that's a little bit sad. And we've had a big talk about it and he's like, yep, you would move to Ireland if I wanted to go home. And I was like, yep. So it's just so beautiful. Anyways, my love, I just wanted to pop in, give you a little life update just to chat to you. But anyway, I'll be back chatting to you on Sunday for another weekly angel guidance. Have an amazing week wherever you are in the world. Oh my gosh. Whatever you're going through right now, if the shit has hit the fan or what, just know that everything is totally working out for your highest good. You don't, may not understand it like me, but you just see all these signs and it's like 444, 777, 999, 333. It's like, it doesn't stop. And I don't know, I feel like ever since I made the decision to invest in my business, start going through the new course and to move, I've noticed a shift in energy. I, I did a tarot, I just put my lip. Ah. I did a tarot card reading and it said it's going to be a rocky beginning, which I've already felt this morning and that's why this video was in the proper video because I couldn't get myself into alignment quick enough in order to film and, and I had to pick, pick Peter up from work and it just didn't work. But anyways, I'm here bringing you a video, letting you know I'm thinking of you and I just love you guys so much. Please comment below because I'll be chatting back to you and um, I'll see you on Sunday. I love you so much.